make a, another trip into Stowe, so I thought I'd bring you along with me. It's a brisky 36 degrees, it's a little bit chilly. Got to pick up my glasses that are in. And on the way back, I'll probably go up over the hill, like I always do. Raise their hogs and beef 
patrol cars in. Well, today must be court day. Look at all them people going to court. They must have been bad. Bad boys, bad boys. And girls. Now I gotta get used to stop sign. They put it here 15 years ago, but I still don't remember it. Catch myself running through. Prisoner in the back seat, and 
somebody hit my cruiser in the bridge, but it, nothing, it was my fault. So I never had to file any against uh, the county's insurance. She had to pay for it all. She told me she didn't even get the car out of third gear. I says, well, it was one of those muscle cars. Uh, it's a 71 Mach 1. things would move. Pin me right into my seat. Had some sore kneecaps for a while. Well, I'll wait for you. I'm in no big rush. I'm going to go down onto this route over here. That farm right there used to make ice cream. Sinos, Sinos fire. It was good tasting stuff too. Now we'll take a right on Route 100 towards the stove.
turn that heat down a little now. Body temperature is back above freezing. Nice old barn right there. I saved the girl's life right here on this corner because it's pinned in a car. Brain damage. The uh, had to be a doctor at the scene said to told me that she's gone. But I didn't give up on her. I started CPR. Like Ollie brought her back. Turned out her father was a neurosurgeon in California. Got a beautiful letter from him thanking me for not giving up on his daughter. Said she was doing well. Appreciated what I did. You never know. But in a lot of cases, if it wasn't that way, you'd lose them. And that's always hard. Like that little barn up there. Wanker's Way. Never name a road called Wanker. <laughs> Don't that beat all? Maybe that's somebody's name. I don't.
was kind to me and let me right through. It's my lucky day. That's kind of a famous place to stay. That's been there for many, many years. Probably one of their oldest ones that are here. Used to be a gas station right next to them about 30 years ago. I remember it being there. Then you get that old town hall there next to it. Still got the bell up in the bell tower. Your turn, my turn. Everybody take a turn. Yep, this is the money town. had three police officers. Now they got about 15 of them. About a $2 million a year budget. One of the fanciest police departments in the county. They're up here on the right hand side, that tannish colored building, fire and rescue and police. Is that a huge building? Boy. a dollar or two. Probably federal tax money. Some of them giveaways. But if we don't take it, somebody else will. places to spend the money, right?
much here. My eye doctor. That's what it says on the sign. They got a chiropractor too, I guess. In case your back's broke. I'll be back.